Hi guys, it's me, Teacher Gon. In our today's video, we will talk about dividing polynomials using synthetic division. So without further ado, let's do this topic. Now let us divide these polynomials using synthetic division. So what we have here is that we have 2x cubed minus 3x squared plus 4x minus 1 divided by x plus 1. Recap lang tayo. This polynomial is your dividend, while this polynomial x plus 1 is your divisor. So the question here is that how are we going to perform synthetic division to divide these polynomials? First, we will get the coefficients of the dividends. We have here 2, negative 3, 4, and this constant, negative 1. We will place it here. So we will start with the leading coefficient. Again, this one is your leading coefficient because this is the coefficient in the term in which the exponent has the greatest exponent. So let's have this one, 2, then negative 3. Next is 4, followed by negative 1. After that, we will get the value of c here. If this is plus 1, we need to get the opposite sign of this number. This is positive 1. It's inverse or additive inverse is negative 1. So we will place it here. And we will enclose it using a half box like this. And here, maglagay tayo ng line for us to perform the synthetic division. Now, since already tapos yung setup natin, we're, we're ready to go with synthetic division. First step is to bring down the leading coefficient. Again, bring down the leading coefficient, which is 2. Then after that, multiply this, the numbers here later, eh? multiply 2, sorry, this is negative 1, okay? Multiply 2 by negative 1, 2 times negative 1 is negative 2. So again, guys, nagkaroon ng correction. If this is positive, its inverse is negative 1, right? So, nakaroon tayo ng correction. 2 times negative 1 is negative 2. Then, add these integers. Negative 3 times or plus negative 2. That is negative 5. Multiply it again with negative 1. 5 times 1. That is 5. Then, add the numbers. 4 plus 5. That is 9. Next, here, 9 times negative 1, that is negative 9. Then add the integers, negative 1 plus negative 9, that is negative 10. Now, recap lang tayo, how did we get 2, negative 5, 9, and negative 10? First, we bring down the leading coefficient. Multiply it here, it became negative 2. Then add these two integers, that is negative 5. Negative 5 times negative 1 is 5. Add these numbers. 4 plus 5 is 9. Then we have 9 times negative 1, which is negative 9. Add these numbers, that is negative 10. So this is the end of our calculation here. And now we will declare our final answer. What is the quotient between these two polynomials after using synthetic division? So now we will use these coefficients. But we need to consider first, what is the first term of our quotient? Since the dividend started with x cubed, again, our dividend started with x cubed, what we need to do is to subtract 1 from the highest exponent. If this is 3, minus 1. So here, in our quotient, automatically, the exponent of the variable x is 2. Again, where did we get x squared? Because... We subtracted 1 from the exponent of x, which is 3. 3 minus 1, which is 2. That is x squared. And then we will use this coefficient here, and that would be 2x squared. Now, pababayan, decreasing yan. If this is x squared, what's next is x na lang. Then we will use this coefficient minus 5. Here, since this is the last variable x, this one will serve as the constant. That would be 9. So what will happen here for this negative 10? That negative 10 or this negative 10 is what you call the remainder. That is the 
remainder. Now, how are we going to express the remainder as an answer? Your negative 10, copy that here, so minus 10. Then put your divisor here, x plus 1. So now, we can declare that our answer, or the quotient is 2x squared minus 5x plus 9, and the remainder is negative 10 over x plus 1. So guys, that's it. I hope you learned something from this video on how to divide polynomials using synthetic division. And by the way, guys, we have plenty of videos about synthetic division and meron din tayo yung long division, yung pag-divide manually, and sana makita nyo siya sa ating comment section. So guys, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to like and subscribe at hit na rin bell button for you to be updated sa ating latest uploads. Again, it's me, Teacher Gon. Maraming maraming salamat. Bye-bye!